I put my heart in this box. They be like, y'all niggas stop it. Uh, we swap a card and they rob us. These promoters and sharks and they partners. Uh, it's gonna be hard trying to stop. I'm speaking for the fans when I say they offended me. Really, y'all part of the problem. Blinded by hate, you don't see the real enemy. Uh, you motherfuckers be tempting me. Don't like your energy. You think you pimping me. Been fighting for over 500 centuries. No penitentiaries. I'm smoking plenty of weed. I don't need no sympathy. Earl Spence versus Crawford. Gonna be all the time. Regardless of who win or lose, they still gonna be in the hall. Fine. So I ain't even in my feelings Regardless of the rain, I'm chilling Numb to the pain, no feeling Can't do the same, no dealing We'll get it, but I ain't no villain Lost my cops, so it ain't no ceiling Ride versus tank, cause I fight them, not feeling Cause we already know that tank gon' kill them I wanna see tank with the dead and hang Even fight more What about Shakur? Boxing is not a sport that we can afford Cause so we know that rich people rob the poor This I cannot ignore I've never been shot before This pain is burning inside When my people died, it's just like a hundred who shot a boy? Damn. I put my heart in this box. They be like, Charlie, need to stop it. We swap our card and they rob us. These promoters, they sharks and they partners. It's gonna be hard trying to stop us. Speaking for the fans when I say they're offending me. But really, y'all part of the problem. Blinded by hate, you don't see the real enemy. What it do? What it do? It's 903 Boxing. I'm your host, Charles J. Yeah, man. Um, <sighs> Ryan, no introduction, man. Gotta get straight to the shit. I see the shit, bro. I see you, motherfuckers. Uh, um, you would think black men are ready for a revolution. You would think black men are ready to storm the capital. Um, you would think black men are just yeah. You think you think we got a. We strapped and ready. We all black. We got the little, yeah, the shit under your eyes, the shit. Yeah, we look real ready. We look real on code. Shit look real organized. Um, nah, I don't respect it, though. Um, is it really, are we really on code? Or are we trying to take up for our favorite fighter? Are we really on code or are we being fanboys? Are we really on code or do most of you motherfuckers really beat on your woman? Are we really on code? Because I don't think you motherfuckers really know what on code is. Got to be honest. Uh, it's a lot of other shit you motherfuckers could have been on code about. Uh, this is a terrible example to be on code about. Uh, it's kind of hard to be on code about a man beating on a black woman. Kind of hard to do that shit. Um... And you know I'm I'm the I'm the motherfucker that sh you know if 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 I was just an ignorant ass Negro I should be the one because I've been falsely put in jail before I've actually done time and a woman lied to me. I've I've actually done that I've went through that and never laid a hand on her but I was put through that situation and I almost went back to prison uh so I know that it's yeah it's many women that's lying on us many women that dry got the man on child support and yeah and he can't see the kids and yeah but now nah, bro you know you know something about black men i'm noticing about you motherfuckers you motherfuckers not only are you weak uh and i say we as a whole because i can't say black men without including myself we weak as a whole you know something i ain't never seen you motherfuckers do you motherfuckers ain't never came together and said, you know what? I ain't for beating no on women. Black men have never denounced that shit. It's always been like a secret. Uh, we don't really touch it. I just want to know. I want black men, and matter of fact, respond to this. Come in and come. Do you beat on your woman? Do you beat on your woman? Do you believe you should slap the dog shit out of a woman? Do you believe in that? That's all I want to know. I just want to know, do you believe in it? Um... That's all I want to know. You know, we always take up for fuck shit. We don't never take up for real shit. Uh, you know, and, and and you motherfuckers coming out with all this evidence. She set him up. Look, it was spit on his face. You motherfuckers. Uh, I've never seen black men advocate so hard for a motherfucker that's known to be abusive to women. Uh, you see the clip I just played? Bro, that ain't no argument. Uh, he snatched her all the way out of her seat in front of everybody. This was in the public, so I can imagine what you do in private. You snatched up, bro. You snatched out the whole arena in front of everybody at a basketball game. 
If you would do that at a basketball game, bro, what would you do in private, bro? So my thing is this, this, this is where I'm telling you, it get real greasy. I'm in the middle of this shit. It's like on one point, on one hand, I hate that this shit is world news. I hate that it's been publicized like this. I hate that. I hate that it's on every goddamn blog. I, I hate that when black men fuck up, the world see it. I, I, I really do hate that. But black man, you motherfuckers look real. You, you Tank ain't gonna send you motherfuckers no check, bro. Uh, Tank ain't very fond of black. <laughs> Let me tell you something. You motherfuckers are advocating for some. Uh, listen, I love Tank as a fighter, this and that, and I wish the boy the best. I wish all young black men the best. But we gotta start. Yeah. Motherfuckers don't get. You know, we don't. We don't discipline. We don't check our, our uh, other other black. Men. We don't check each other. When it's time to check them, this is the time to t uh, check time. Whether you did it or not, bro, we 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 saw you when you snatched that girl up. Uh, we should have addressed you way back then. No thing about your tank. This is why I think you do beat on women, bro. You hang around number rap. You fuck with rappers, and that's all. Every rapper beat on this woman. Uh, rapper, that's what they do. Uh, all that shit, and then get some neck from them. That's all the rappers talk about. Rappers beat on women. And they publicly say that shit. And you hang with little babies and all that. You you the rapper that all the rappers and all the young kids like. You you like a rapper fighter, Tank. And so this is why I, I, I'm telling you, I don't give a fuck if I lose subscribe. I don't give a fuck if you motherfuckers never listen to me again. I'm not going to stand up for it, bro. I don't give a fuck how shiny them Bendis is you got. I don't give a fuck how much money. Uh, every, uh, little baby can walk you out to a fight. The baby out. Young boy can walk you out to a fight, bro. That shit don't impress me. And so a lot of times we get to idolizing men, but we don't know how to check on when he wrong. Nah, Pimpin, you wrong, bro. You wrong. And all that why me and crying the river, bro. Um, I don't know. Maybe she did set you. I don't know. But I think you beat on women regularly. Yeah, I think that's what you do. Uh, I saw how aggressive you snatched her up. That yeah, that looked normal to you, and shit like that. So yeah, I think you. That's what you do, and I think you think it's okay. A lot of young black men think it's okay to beat on women. So that's what I'm addressing. While all you motherfuckers trying to act like you on code, and you know, and I seen an old school. Um, I seen an old school. Uh, what's his name? Yeah, I seen him post some shit like. Um, it was about Kovlov and what he did, which I mentioned that in my last video. And it was like that on some shit like, yeah, but what about Kovlov? And it was funny and shit, cool. But my thing is this, though. When are we going to say it's not okay to beat on our uh, black women no more? I just want to know when we going to say that. Listen, I understand it's white boys beat on their women mess and they don't get they don't get publicized. But when are we going to say it ain't right, though? That's the only point. That's that's my whole point in this. I'm a com I'm a complete contradiction of myself if I don't talk about this. I'm a contradiction as a man if I don't speak on this. So a lot of you motherfuckers, uh, I see you, bro. Y'all know y'all know how to get on code for some bullshit. Uh, are you on code, motherfuckers? Let me ask you this: Why wouldn't you motherfuckers on code for Connor Ben? Uh, the shit Connor Ben did was way less than what Tank did. Tank hit on women. Connor Ben just took some dope and tried to, yeah, steroids to try to win a fight. Why we didn't take up for him? Why we didn't take up for old big baby Jarrell Miller when he got caught before he fought Joshua? And yeah, he was just doing steroids. He wasn't beating on no woman, though. You motherfuckers didn't get on code for that. Oh, what about Fatback Fury when we found out about the loaded gloves and all? Let me just tell you something about gangster shit and, and how uh, black Americans act when a brother do some shit. Bro, if you do some fuck shit off in these streets, bro. Yeah, like with the gloves, uh, shit would have shit would have went a whole nother way if there was a black fighter, bro. Uh, how how fear was white or able to come back over here in America and tour all around the country and pull up and this and that and this and, that. and 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 his car was never vandalized, nothing never happened. A fan never uh, uh threw some shit at him, threw an orange at his head and that. So I'm just saying, when are we on code? A lot of you motherfuckers that think uh, Fury loaded his gloves and you were so mad at him. A lot of you motherfuckers would have got an autograph if you seen him in person. A lot of you motherfuckers would try to get an interview or some weird shit like that. So I just want to know, uh, is it really on code? What the fuck is a code? What, what the fuck are we on? You know, um, a lot of you motherfuckers think on code is the, um, 
yeah, um, lift the code of the streets and the streets and the streets don't talk, bro. The streets have been talking for for decades, bro. Uh, uh, all these cartel, all the mob, they all tell, bro. Telling is in the streets. So all this shit, I'm just looking at all these codes we try to uplift that don't mean shit. You motherfuckers trying to have some code about some dope. Everybody tell about that dope when they get caught. Yeah, now at least 90%. Oh, that's what they do. So what, what kind of code do we live by? What, what kind of codes? What, what, what is a code? What kind of code do we really have, bro? Because we don't got a code to say, hey, when a brother beat on his woman, it's looked down. Up. It ain't looked down upon to beat on your woman as a black. It ain't looked down upon. Brothers ignore. Let me tell you something. These days, uh, a brother, a brother beat his woman in front of all his homies. And, and these motherfuckers will sit there and keep smoking blunts and, and probably laugh about it. Uh, let me tell you something about me, bro. In my most thuggish of days, I ain't never had a home where I think he can beat on this woman in front of me. Nah, you could never do that, bro. Just always been in me. Uh, nah, bro, I ain't finna, you ain't finna beat on your woman in front of me, bro. That shit ain't finna go down. So, yeah, and you wouldn't be my homie. And I wouldn't look at you like a man, pimpin'. Uh, nah, I just don't, bro. I'm, I just want to come out and say some shit that ain't cool. I know a lot of motherfuckers ain't gonna like. Nah, bro, I don't think it's cool to beat on your woman, and I want to make it to where it ain't cool. I want to make it to where that shit ain't cool, bro. Um, I don't know. I want a few motherfuckers' little sister came to you, and both eyes was black, and yeah, and and her baby daddy had been jumping on her. And I know you get that pack from them. I know you get that seven grams of that soft for the low from them. But I want to know if you would have took that, cause, you, cause I wonder if you would have valued your cocaine habit over protecting your sister. That's what I want to know about a lot of you, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, I want to know if you would have said, "Fuck that seven grams of cocaine he giving me," and yeah, and you, and I'm tired of you beating on my sister, and I'm fuck that, fuck that dope you giving me for the low. Yeah, uh, I'm finna beat your ass for fucking with my sister, bro. Nah, bro. At this point, we ain't got no motherfucking code of ethics. So, and I'm gonna be honest with you. That's why I'm kind of, bro. I'm really one deep. Yeah, I'm in this shit one because black men are too sensitive anyway. Uh, you could like me for uh ninety percent of my videos. I make one video you motherfuckers don't like, and it's fuck charge. That's how we are as black men. We very critiqueish and shit. Yeah, I make one video that you motherfuckers don't like, and I ain't gonna fuck with them for about a month. Yeah, you motherfuckers sensitive like that. So I hope this really sensitized your motherfucking ears, and I hope you motherfuckers can soak this shit in like a sponge. Uh, uh study the shit. Uh, yeah, do some shit like that. Because uh, at this point, I don't give a fuck about no, because we don't have no code as black men. You motherfuckers don't even care about respect. So I don't I, I don't give a fuck about you mother. I don't give a fuck about none of you motherfuckers. Um, I'm not joining this shit. I'm not joining this uh, take up for Tank shit. Fuck Tank. Uh, tank Tank got a monkey tattoo. I'm just to stop it. Uh, tank, tank diss a black fighter every chance he get. So you motherfuckers act like Tank is the Malcolm X of boxing or some shit. Tank ain't never even stood up for black folk. Uh, Tank uh, respect uh, white men more than he respect black men. He don't respect black men. I ain't never seen Tank disrespect a white fighter or a white man. Or let alone a Latin. He only disrespect black people. He's the rapper. Uh, yeah, he's like a rapper fighter. You know, and, and I said you was growing up, bro. And I and like I said, I said, I said out at there and I was proud of you and this and that. But now, nah, bro, when when it come down to it, and 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 it boil down to it, it's either take up a tank or speak against beating on women. It's either take up a tank and say it's cool to beat on my woman, or it's go against it. That's it, you can't be in the middle. It's only one of the two. I hate the shit with publicized. I hate that the world seen it. But right is right and wrong is wrong. Do I support men beating on women? Do I support that or do I support Tank? Who does beat on Tank beat on women, bro? I don't give a fuck what you motherfuckers think. That wasn't no one time thing, bro. So uh, it's either one of the two. You can't be in between. So yeah, um, at this point, man, like I said, I don't, bro. I swear to God, I, sometimes I hate I even name myself nine hundred three boxing. I wish I had said nine hundred three just just nine or, or some other shit because boxing is too corrupt. And too fake. Uh, that's why a lot of times I don't even want to cover the shit. And a lot of you fans are fake to me. So um, I don't have no honor for boxing. I don't have no honor for a black fighter. 
I don't have honor for none of these fighters. Um, black men have become prostitutes. We the prostitutes of America. Black men are prostitutes. And we proud prostitutes. That's all black. It used to be sisters I always say, yeah, you got to do what you got to do to get that money, baby. No, nah, that's what black men say. Nah. nah. Brothers, now, nah. Shit. Man, you got 10 bands for it, bro. Yeah, that's how black men talk like now. Nah. So, yeah, I think we soft as shit. And I think a lot of you motherfuckers that ain't speaking on this, you soft. And uh, I think you beat on your woman. And I tell you what, uh, I don't give a fuck if I'm in a public place. If you beating on a black woman, I don't give a fuck. White boy, that's white business. Mexican, Mexican business. But if a black man is beating on a black woman, I don't give a fuck where I'm at. I'm jumping in, bro. Yeah, I'm getting in that shit because I don't stand for that. I feel like, what if that was my sister? What if that was my sister? Would I just sit there and let a man beat on her? Nah, bro, that ain't never been cool. It ain't never been a man bigger. A man is stronger than a woman. A man naturally outweigh a woman. It ain't never been cool for a man to hit a woman. So now uh, I can't stand for that, bro. If I don't speak up for nothing else in life, I'm going to speak up for that. Don't no woman deserve to get hit on. Yeah, a lot of y'all talk too much shit. A lot of you act too tough. You don't deserve to get hit on. Yeah, just leave her, bro. Yeah, just leave her if you feel, if you feel like you got to beat her to be with her. So now, fuck you, bitch ass. And like I said, I ever catch a brother hitting on a woman anywhere. I don't give a fuck where I'm at. I'm jumping in and I'm sliding on you, pimping. This is 903 Bison. I am your host, Charles J. With that, I'm out.